Hey folks, Stephen Hook from Nashville Steam. We've got a number of different projects going on in our shop today. We're inviting you to come in and take a look. Starting here on the tender truck frames, we're in the final stages of assembling our new pedestal liners to the truck frame. These liners are assembled in three pieces to ensure that we get a tight fit to prevent cracking and premature wear as the locomotive is traveling down the railroad. We're filling out these corners to ensure a nice ground radius that will allow the box to interface nicely with the truck frame. Up next, we're moving on to our steam chest where we're setting up a portable boring system to put the final machining touches on the new valve cases, your valve liners as they're referred to. As it stands right now, the valve would not have a very tight or precision fit and could lead to leaking if we installed the valve as is. So we're using our portable boring setup to machine a final fit that will allow the cages or the liners to match the valve. The boring bar, how it sets up is you have a set of bearings on each end and a bar that passes through the middle. A cutting tool is affixed to the bar and as the bar rotates, it's almost like a reverse lathe action. The tool can be advanced out and as it spins around, it will cut material off of each wall concentrically creating a tight machine fit up to a thousandth of an inch in precision. Since our last update, as you can see, we've had the opportunity to drive our entire engineer's side sheet worth of stables. Now these rigid stables are only about halfway done. Now we have to drive them on the inside, which will be a significantly less amount of driving than what you see here. That'll allow us to put a seal weld and ultimately increase the life of our bolts across the service life of, life of the locomotive. A lot of both big and small pieces that go into a steam locomotive. Our goal with these simultaneous projects and large work sessions is to be maintaining progress on both fronts. All of these pieces here are off the tender trucks. We are working on going through inspecting, cleaning, and painting all of the individual small components to ensure that when they are assembled into one larger machine, we have a resilient and sound machine. What you see going on behind me we are actively welding the new washout sleeves onto the back head section that we replaced. These washout sleeves are critical for cleaning the boiler during our mandated boiler washes. It also allows us the opportunity to have a window inside the boiler to inspect as the locomotive is working through its operating season. Then over on the far side, you can hear the grinding noise. We have another crew that is working on dressing the stay bolts on the fireman's side sheet to make sure that they're ready to be driven. That should take place here in the next few weeks. As we get closer and closer to our hydro and our steam test, what you're looking at today has become the new normal for Nashville Steam. We have as many as 11 volunteers in one day throughout our six day a week work session period that are working on multiple projects at one time. By having so many simultaneous projects, this energy allows us to maintain momentum towards achieving our final goals in a much shorter amount of time. This summer, we're making it a steam shop tradition to be checking things off of the list. If you want to learn more and support our project, please visit us at nashvillesteam.org.